Hello my friends, it's your friend Alex, the Super Nintendo Gamer. Welcome back to this channel and this week's episode of the Alex Gamer Show. Now today is kind of a rainy day, so what do we do for rainy day? There's only one thing to do. It's to show this Pokemon Nintendo DS carrying case by Nintendo. And I'm going to ask you guys a question. What version of the fourth generation Pokemon game did you guys play? Did you, did you play Pokemon Diamond or Pokemon Pearl? Let me know down in the comments below. Okay. This is a spec now we know we just like like a bunch of different carrying cases like for your DS and like 3DS and Wii U and the Switch. And this is an old Nintendo DS carrying case and this was made in 2007. Now a little different now it's a little different from the other carrying cases because it's got the design on it's got the Pokemon Diamond Pearl design on it. And then you see Dalgia and we see Palgia. Now this is a really now this is a really cool case and like all like the other stuff you don't see too much stuff out like this. Also, oh, and we're also going to peek inside it. Okay, there's the zip. Oh, before that, here's the zipper part. We just take this zipper and we just open it up. It gets a little stuck, but we good. Okay, now we got open. Here's what's inside of it. <coughs> Excuse me. And we also see right here this little tag right here it says it's made in 2007 by Nintendo and Pokemon. And we're actually I'm gonna put my DS in here. My Nintendo DS Lite. We're gonna put it right in this case. And we'll show you guys how to do it. Put it in just like that. And we're gonna close it up. And you feel the weight in this thing, and this case is real nice because it protects your DS nicely, and it's just got a cool design on it, and it's actually pretty durable. You feel them like there's enough fabric part here to give it like an extra protection in case you like drop it or it falls off like the shelf, it gives it better protection. And that's what's nice about these carrying cases. Every game should always have a carrying case in case they they drop this system or it falls off like the shelf or anything. That way it protects it really good. And also, too, we're also going to see if my original Nintendo DS will fit inside it. I don't know if it will not. I think this is for the lights. But we're going to find out here. There's only one way to find out. Is to open it up. Okay, here we go. Well, the question is, will the original DS fit in this Pokemon DS camera case or will it not? We'll find out here. Let's see here. We're going to put it in here. We've got this little screen right here. Okay, let's see if it fits. It does! It fits! See? This fits perfectly. And here's what it looks like. So it fits. So this is for both the original... Oh, gotta get that cord back in there. So this is both for the original Nintendo DS and the Nintendo DS Lite. I don't know if it's for the DSi or Nintendo DSi XL because I don't have those, but I assume it would fit the DSi. But since this came out about one of the DS and the DS Lite time period, I think this is probably more for the DS and DS Lite. Cool, this is also a nice case. If you're a Pokemon fan, this would be worth collecting and putting in your collection set. Because it's got Dalgian and Palkia, and it's got the original Pokemon Diamond version, Pokemon Pearl version, the artwork on it. Oh yeah, I forgot to show you. I'm going to put the DS Lite back in so you guys can see what it looks like in the case. So this is a really nice case, guys, because I really like showing you, me and my friends, all this cool stuff because it usually, sometimes the stuff is hard to find. See, here's what Nintendo Lite looks like. Nintendo DS Lite looks like. It's totally cool. Really cool, huh? And these are really nice to keep your cases, they keep your DS clean, these cases are really awesome. And I recommend having these. And these are just nice collection sets to have. And there's, we've seen the inside, oh yeah, and there's what it looks like on the back. Really cool design, and I was gl really glad to show it to you guys today because we've been showing a lot of like the Jack Pacific toys here lately, and I want to show you guys something really different. And I was going through my stuff, and I found this. And I looked at it, so I gotta show this to my friends. You gotta show this on the show. So, 
I got it out, cleaned it up a little bit, and I showed it to you guys today. And that's pretty much it for today's show. And and I want to ask you guys a question: How do you, what do you guys think of this button, Nintendo taking shutting down the online system for the Nintendo 3DS and Wii U? Let me know down in the comments below, and don't forget to check my video on about it. I always kind of, I always thought that Shane. We're always going to talk about a little bit, not a little. I kind of miss the DS. I play more on the DS and the Wii U. Well, that's all for today's show. If you like this video, please give a like, a share, and a comment. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel to get more notifications and updates on the Alex Gamer Show and seeing a new episode each week at 10 a.m. every Saturday. And this is where we talk, review, and showcase video game products. See you guys next week, my friends. God bless you and have a nice day. Bye-bye.